We were looking for a void saint with whom we could converse, in the course of which we learned of you. We are visitors to this world, and know little and less of its workings and ways. We'd be grateful if you could tell us about it, and yourself. So it's information you seek. What do you offer for it? Well, we've literally saved you from the dark, but... Void Saint crave one, one thing alone, ether. In return for information, I offer you mine. It's not all of it, mind you. I still have need of my life. <laughs> Very well. I will tell you no more than you can afford to pay. Whoa, cold screenshot. This is where I belong. Oh. My home. This endless darkness you call the void. There was once light here, and it shone its warmth upon creation. The lands were green and the seas were blue. Life flourished. That was crazy as fuck. Before the war. The Contra Memoria. Contra Memoria. It must have been a terrible war indeed. So is this what uh, Igiom, I forget her name now. Shattered the balance, causing darkness to engulf the world. Yeah, yeah she started it. it up. Yeah, she started it, right? All life was transformed into monstrosities. Void scent. I'd be so proud of myself Maybe if I called that she was one in the portrait. Now. As light begat sin eaters, darkness begat void scent. Right. I was on the money. The sun was driven from the sky as fleeting day yielded to endless night. In time, even land and sea lost their distinction. Jeez. And though the spark of reason had died in us, driven by memory's shadow, we formed factions and carved out domains. God damn. This castle, for instance, its erstwhile lord must have abided in such a place once upon a time. If I may, the darkness in you is too much for any man to harbor. To my eyes, you are indeed a void scent. Yes, yeah, so how is she fine? Past yeah. And your demeanor mark you apart from your brethren. You are different. That much is plain. But in what way, I am unsure. But what if she's as dire? I am void scent. But only in part. The darkness touched my mother when the war had only just begun, when I was still in the womb. Oh, God! Whoa. As a child, I looked like any other. But darkness coursed through me, and I ceased to age when I'd become a woman grown. Damn. But that was then. And now, I may as well be one in full. Not really, you seem much more composed than the others. I prey on the weak and serve the strong. I live to survive. Nothing more. Damn. Forgive me. It was not my intent to pry. Oh. I realize, too, that I have neglected to ask your name. Be careful, Yashola. How much ether is this sapping? mortal, you may call me Void Scent. That is liable to cause confusion. <laughs> if you are not averse, we would address you by your true name. And if you don't want to have one, now's the time to make one. Well, I care not. Oh my god. I can't just name I like a pet dog. Call it Taru. <laughs> <laughs> How about Zero? Zero. That's pretty cool. Meaning nothing. A name as fitting as any. I was more thinking like I was more thinking like Zoro, but you know. No, not nothing, but rather a beginning. For it remains to be seen what you will become to us. Zero. As I said, I care not. Zero then. Already, Damn. already. What a peculiar character, dude. <laughs> I think it's a nice name. I think it's a nice name, but I don't think she'll appreciate that, so. Here's to a fruitful partnership. 
Which she probably won't appreciate either, but still. Yep. Partnership? Are you saying you wish to strike a bargain? She doesn't understand the concept of camaraderie or friendship, you know? <laughs> well, Zero, while there is no end to the questions we could ask, it is only fair that we tell you our purpose in coming here. We are searching for a dragon. One who came to your world long ago. Ajdaya is her name, and she is my sister. <clears throat> if you have any knowledge of her, I beg you, share it with us. <sighs> yeah. Oh, it's gone! There was, a vo there was like a portal thingy there. Hmm. Did you say something? You only he heard it. That's fucking, that's, that's her, man. That's fucking as dire, man, I'm telling you. I thought I heard a voice as well. The keening of void scent, perhaps. No, she's all crazy, man. She's lost her mind. Okay. I must say, we are rather exposed here. Perhaps we should continue the conversation within the castle. All right, Zero. Wait, don't steal all Ether now and yeah, kill everybody. Not too much Ether, please. This place is as good as any. Let me have the Ether now. Very well. Imagine just channeling ether to people. Life essence. Oh, oh. fuck. You're mine. Oh, oh shit, what the fuck? Dodge. It's the it's the beach. Ah, that I should miss my mark. Scamilione. Scamilione. That fiend again. But we struck it down. Yeah, watched, watched it, it die. die. Yep. <laughs> Fools. Death doesn't exist in this world, and I. I am free to return whensoever I please. Christ? Death doesn't exist. <gasps> of course, in the first, the power of light, of passivity, prevents life from emerging in the empty. Ooh. But in the third, but here is the, opposite. the power of darkness, of activity, prevents life from finding rest even should soul be separated from flesh. Oh God. Oh my God. So one's essence is absorbed by another. It is possible to return again and again. So this is why we need Zero in our party. So she can absorb the shit. Hmm. Your ether. <gasps> it is reminiscent of that creature's. Ah. Oh. My mouth waters at the memory. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? The fuck? I must devour you too. No, he said yes, she said poo. Must. Yeah, but uh, 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 as Daya can't be dead because nothing can die here. So does that you got that going for it too, right? By my power be reborn! Unless she literally did fucking devour the entirety of a dragon. Which I don't know, man, it seems unlikely. This boss wasn't that tough. What's happening? What the fuck? Okay, maybe the boss is pretty tough, man. Death they want. <laughs> I say we give it to them. Oh shit, dude. There's no fucking way, man, that this idiot ate Ash man. Bye, Zero. <clears throat> if you could lend us a hand, we'd be much obliged. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. Ask it. That you would. But you already owe me a debt. And until you make good in it, I won't lift a finger. How about you get to devour all of these fiends? Huh? We'll speak after you've won. But know that if you lose, I'll help myself to your ether. God damn zero. <laughs> that a bothersome duty should deliver what to me this lavish feast. Come, struggle with all your might. 
It will make you that much okay. richer and tastier. Why could I sense a, like a twinge of Welsh in there, like a Welsh accent? <laughs> Gonna get them Welsh voids in going. Every soul in this domain serves me now. Okay, fucking up everything with my insane DPS. Go tight and fuck him up, dude. Ah. I got them. The of yep. Oh, God. Well, I'm okay, moving away from that shit. Yeah, me too. Everybody else is free to stand in it. it means to resurrect them again. Mm, let them come. What the fuck, little dude? He hastens their regeneration. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna need you to fucking lend a goddamn hand here. Uh, Miss Zero. Zero, for God's sake. Look at her just watching, man. She didn't give a shit. Mm, I know. Fuck's sake. Has too great an advantage. He's like Luna. We need to drag him out of this damnable feast. All right, that was surely the last weave. Zero! Help us! Come and eat them for fuck's sake. Oh my god, dude. Oh, cutscene? Cutscene! Oh. Zero's cat doesn't do unless once. Yeah, man. <laughs> oh my god. Why is it they give me soulless music? No matter what you do, you cannot hope to win. It's the medicine music, man. It's the medicine music. You never know until you try, and I'm always happy to experiment. And she's still in a good mood. Yep. Zero! Is there no way to stop them from coming back? There is, but I have no reason to share it with you. Oh. <laughs> 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 uh. Dim, dim, dim. Think, you stole a think. You know, Zero, you do owe us for one thing. Oh. Your name. You'll have your promised ether, but we are owed compensation for your name. Oh, yeah, we did give it to her free of charge. Yeah, we did give her a name. True. Very true. A name for which I did not ask. But we Don't give it to you it? anyway. <laughs> but that I nevertheless did accept. <laughs> Woo! Okay, man, what's she gonna do, man? What's she gonna do? She gonna devour the shit out of them? Oh. Okay, sick. Oh. Darkness crystals, don't touch it. Don't touch it. Terrify Thancred. They've been crystallized. Okay, Pog, Pog. Well now, that's quite the trick. I like how goddamn Sigmly is is looking at this like, fuck! Just taking it. Pretty effective. Very effective. Satisfied? Thank Pretty you. sick. <laughs> Come, my friends. With Zero's aid, we can defeat him. What is this? <laughs> what have you done? Pissed. Now that I think on it, you owe me a debt as well. You know, I have a feeling that this scam the only is some mark, sort of dragon. But I won't miss mine. Like, ooh, let's go zero. It's got four tentacles, like the, the four wings for the dragon. Well, she's gonna turn scam Milione into a into a little crystal, and it's gonna turn out that uh, 
This guy is in there somewhere, you know? Like he's been assimilated. See, you know the dragons in this world, they have four wings, don't they? And these true, are very floating. True, true. However, a death oh. is dead. For Norman. Right, I, I, oi, I, oi, I, oi, I oi, oi. repay it here and now. We have to kill the minions first, right? Be gone. Okay. How do we do that? Don't know. Oh, nice. She's taking care of the men. Ah, cool. More servants. <laughs> oh, shit in hell. I took stupendous damage there, dude. Did you stand in the middle still? Yeah, I sat, I sat in the middle like an idiot, man. I was looking at chat. <laughs> <laughs> Not a good time to be looking at chat, man. At least you stole like, healing me up. Yeah, you stole the healing me as well. She good, Kes. Good, Kes. Kes bind. No zeros bound. We cannot win without zero. We must help her. The goddamn filthy shackle. Yeah. Uh, guys, you're standing in the airway. Guys. Yeah, man, we have to break out before they get fucked. I'm trying, but. She's out. She's out. She's out. Oh my goodness. All right. Berlin's like 10% for me. 18% for me. We must stop him now. Holy shit. Nice one, Vashan, dude. Look at the little dragon skill shield that he put up, man. Yeah, man. Look at that. That looks fucking Green. cool, dude. Front screen. Looks limey. And is the Duh. Dead now. Oh my god. Zero just butchered it. Fools! Do not think I defeated me. Well done, Zero. Thank you. I will return again and again. Will you though? How can see oh. my flesh? Why won't it heal? What is the meaning of this? It's gonna turn into a crystal, dude. I'm crystal. <gasps> Memoria. But how? How can you have this power? Memoria. Death has no place in this world. We are beyond it. Now how do you have this power? Oh. Ah, Lord Goldness, you have sent me to my doom. Curse you and your wretched flattery and this abominable fate. Oh. So many names. Golbez. Man, they like the crystals from Crash Bandicoot. Who oh, use those crystals for anything? Oh! The echo, the echo, the echo. Oh, yeah, good idea. You were a little ahead of me, though. I know, I couldn't stop any of that dialogue, man. Oh shit. Yeah, it's that um, armor dude that we saw a glimpse of before. Right. He's a fucking galley in shoulders. You are welcome, seekers of might. Perfect. I, Golbez, have called you four hither. To be the eye of Sauron. Look at that. I, who will oh, see us triumph in the coming crusade. That I may entrust you with command of our armies. Armies? Yes, yes, but one of the crew's gift. In exchange for our loyalty, we are to feast on the finest 
evil. That shifty one is fucking scaring me. And so you shall, for if you are to serve me, you must be strong. But there's, there's only the pack, and pray we are not disappointed. Alluring void center. Behold. Behold. Huh? No, stay it. <clears throat> you son of a bitch. The fiery wings, the savage horns. It pulses with life. Such vibrant ether. Oh shit. This magnificent creature could only come from beyond the veil. Dude. Indeed. Feast, my friends. Feast and arise as my four arch fiends. God damn, they got them hyenas from the Lion King Mint. Gorge yourselves. As they are now, they can consume but a fraction of the dragon's ether. Okay, so the dragon's still alive. See? I said he couldn't have ate all of it. <laughs> Just as well. The creature may yet serve other ends. Oh, fuck. Yeah, thanks, for for th thanks for saying that to yourself so that we could overhear it. <laughs> Means that Ash die is still still out there, man. My goddamn cloak, man. The crystal's going through my fucking through my cloak, man. The void sense essence remains. But it has been sealed away, transformed into crystal. Memoria. Scamilione called them. Scamilione, Scamilione. I remember them. Man. I take it they are connected to the war of which you spoke. Scamilione. Aye, their use was central to the Contra Memoria, hence its name. And to my knowledge, the transformation is permanent. Oh. I see. We thank you for coming to our aid. I repaid a debt, and in doing so ensured that I receive my own due compensation, which I shall have now. Yes, Give yes. the woman her ether, please. I still have work to do, <laughs> so I would thank you not to get carried away. <laughs> Here we go again, man. Attempt number two. That makes us even, I trust. Not. Right then. When you picked up the crystal, you experienced a vision, did you not? I did. Sure did. The die is We have to go and kick Golbez's ass. A dragon resembling a great worm. I dare to hope that it was Ashdaya. Even as it pains me to think she has been made to suffer. For the ambitions of this Golbez. We've been given much to consider. Let us take a moment to review what we know. What's he gonna say? Hmm. Alexandre Sophie, you come to the 13th before, yes? You fought mm -hmm. Void Center here. Yep. Yes, we did a long while back, but, but clearly you didn't know they could rege uh, regenerate unless you would have shared that detail beforehand. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we just kind of killed them and they stayed dead. That's true. Yeah, they seemed to stay dead at the time, yep. Mm. I doubt not that they did. There must be a reason why the ones you defeated did not return in contravention of the natural order. Do you remember aught out of the ordinary? 
see a ceiling magic like zeros, perhaps. No, they just kind of died, right? There are circumstances in which we are unable to return. If you like, I can tell you about this. The more you devour, the more powerful you grow. But in the process, your essence is blended with those of your prey. Hmm. If you were to lose your flesh, the souls you had be had come to harbor may break free and coalesce into distant, distinct void scent once more. Before you yourself return, your own soul might be devoured by your enemies or your erstwhile prey. However, even assuming you survived the process, it's highly uncommon to return as you were. Yet despite his greater strength, Scamiluguri right, managed to resurrect rather swiftly. Scamilionic! Are the others capable of the same? He's gonna call him fucking Scar. <laughs> Not that I'm aware of. His attachment to his flesh must have been unique for him to develop such an ability. I believe we understand the fundamentals of rebirth now. If I may, I would ask you about your power. Will you tell us about it? <laughs> what you saw should speak for itself. I can bind the ether of the soul into crystal. Many wielded this power during the Contra Memoria, but I'm the only one left. How does one come to wield Memoria? And what happens to your peers? What happened to your peers? Hmm. I never thought about that. I do know though that Void Scent can't use the power. I assume I can I can because I'm mortal in part. I see. Zero, I wish to ask you about the man called Golbez. He may well uh, have my sister in his clutches. Is there aught you can tell us of him? The name sounds vaguely familiar, though I can't say how I know it. He is powerful, however. Someone in the castle may have heard of him. Then we must try talking to the other void scent again. Golbez, you say? My mistress spoke of him. He commands the Archvines. They are very powerful and have conquered many domains. Mistress bade us defend the castle from them. Yes, yes, she did. Seems the Archvines have been attacking other domains. Their feast and reputation precedes them. Corpes. I know of him from those I've eaten. Yeah, there you go. He has minions. And those minions have minions. No one ever sees him. Welcome back, Alexar. Were you able to learn auto value? Only that gold base is crazy as hell. <laughs> and they all seem to fear him. Yep. Oh, the spooky music. So countless voids sent answer to the Archfiends, who in turn answer to Golbez, as your vision did suggest. Scamilione's aggression is also consistent with the claims that the Archfiends can conquer other domains. Question is, how do we reach Golbez if he surrounds himself with armies of minions? Could target his other Archfiends, or perhaps those who have fled his service. Either may yield useful information. What do you think, Zero? Oh, that said, we can't do much while we're stuck on this isle. Zero, I would ask a favor of you. I'm determined to save my sister, Ajdaya. If there is even a faint possibility that Golbez has her, then I must find him. To that end, will you lend us your strength and knowledge? Will you accompany us on our quest? Forgotten the way of my world already. If you want help, offer payment. None here will aid you without... Uh, will, none here will aid you at the kindness of their hearts. Any who claim otherwise are liars and betrayers. Ah, damn. Or is this less a request and more of a threat? If I refuse, will you force me to serve? What the fuck? Truly, you must like, desire something, right? The first one's useless because she helped us. So, it's literally useless. Uh, yeah, it's a bit stupid. Surely you must desire something. Name it, yeah? Yeah. See if you're just going to force it to fucking help us. I have no purpose. Why would I desire anything? That's why I yeah. didn't bother to resist when the ones when the ones here fell upon me. What matters in a world that's already dead? God damn. By that logic, you've no reason to refuse our requests. The payment needs be to your satisfaction, correct? Did I not already say as much from the start? Very well, Zero. I propose you travel with us. Whenever you perform a deed that requires payment, we will provide it in ether. Sure hope that she's a good guy at heart, you know, and... That's all you had to say. Everything else was superfluous. 
Fair point. Where to now? Either a place the Ark Fiends may strike next, or where refugees and deserters may seek sanctuary. I know the latter. I'll take you there. <laughs> I assume you also know how we can get off this isle. I was brought here on a mount. We can leave the same way. Oh. Now that you mention it, I did notice some flying creatures near the terraces. Given our numbers, we'll need a large one. But regardless of size, all can be won with that one over with ether. Bloody hell. Excellent. Let's go find our mount at once. Oh shit. Who's watching? Someone's usually watching. <gasps> Floating head. What's an eye? Not good. Not good business here of this. Me, 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 me. He's gone, man. Nice sound effect. 